Hi, boys and girls. How are you? This is your coach, Noel, and I am so excited. I am so happy, and I am so thrilled that you are joining me today on our first lesson going over these multisyllable words. Again, for joining us, and I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for allowing me to help your child improve in the area of reading. So with that said, we have a lot to cover, so look, let's go ahead and get started with these multi-syllable words. And you're going to notice that some of these words have two colors and three colors, and you may even notice that they have four or five colors as well. So when you see a word with two colors, that means that it has two syllables. When you see a word with three colors, that's going to mean that the word has three syllables, okay? So let's go ahead and let's get started. Ready? This word says a bull. The word is able. The next one says ac -si dent The word is accident. This one says a cross. The word is across. Next one says ac shun. The word is action. This word says ad di shun. The word is addition. Let's move on, okay? This word says ad Dress. The word is address. This word says a adult. The word is adult. The next one is ad -ven -ture. The word is adventure. This word says ad verb. The word is adverb. Ready? The next one is after word. The word is afterward. And take a look. This one has four syllables. Ready? A Agree a bow. The word is agreeable. The next one is air plane. The word is airplane. The next one is a Alaska. The word is Alaska. And the last one for today is a live. The word is alive. So let's go ahead and let's read these one last time before we move on. Ready? Able, accident, across, action, addition. Ready? Let's move on. Address, adult, adventure, adverb, afterward. Ready? Agreeable, airplane, Alaska, and finally alive. Wow, boys and girls, that was impressive. I know that you were with me the entire time. These multisyllable words, you're going to see them over and over again when you're reading. So it's really important that you join me on these lessons, okay? And a reminder to you that this is not a race. You're able to watch this lesson again anytime you want. And remember, reading, writing, listening, and speaking, they're all related. So if you can read it, you can write it. If you can write it, you can read it. And if you can read it, you can say it. Awesome, boys and girls. So we're going to see you soon. Parents, again, thank you very much from the bottom of my heart for allowing me to help your child improve in the area of reading. With that said, thank you so much, take care, and bye-bye.